So, let me get some topics, man. And rather, let me know when you want to chime in, yeah? So, this is oh, something that I thought it kind of, it kind of pissed me off and rubbed me the wrong way, man. I saw mm. a devil from England hella proud, hella proud, man. And this is what's wrong with England. These devils in England are proud, and this is why they're proud, man. They're proud because they're the biggest thieves. They're proud because they're the biggest murderers. And they're humble about it. When we kill someone, when a black man kills something, someone, sorry, we go jail, and we don't come out of jail until we what? Rehabilitated, man. Until we're fixed up. Meanwhile, they've killed and raped and robbed oil in many different countries, and they ain't rehabilitated, man. Right. We can't get jail until we feel sorry for our actions, man. They are the biggest criminals that don't feel sorry for their actions, man. Let me play this for you real quick, man. We have defeated every single country in the world at war. Name a country, Gary. Germany. Germany, 45, thank you very much. <laughs> very recent job done, twice in one century. If they tried again around 99, we've got the fucking hat trick. <laughs> Another country, please. Argentina, 82, no help for no one else. And that, of course, was a war not for oil, but for penguins. Because we all know penguins are an essential ingredient in making Guinness. Don't they? <laughs> <laughs> you boil them up, the white stuff floats to the top, job done. Another country, please. Another one, France, thank you. We're in 1815 Waterloo. We haven't heard from them since. Yeah, another one, please. Canada. Yeah, Canada used to be part of the British Empire, which means they're an ally of ours, as you know, being an ally of ours, counts as losing to us. <laughs> Why else am I getting so miserable? Another one, please. Hey? Spain, 1588, Battle of the Armada. Thank you, sir. We haven't heard from them since. Another one. Uganda, uh, that's an African colony, of course, that at one point used to belong to the Germans. And in 1919, the League of Nations, as you know, when the Treaty of Versailles, when the world was redivided, the African colonies were partitioned, uh, separated between France and, uh, and Great Britain. We got Uganda as a result simply of uh, it being defeat the Germans. We got given Uganda, which sounds like fucking winning there without even having to go there. Result. Mm, okay, okay. He proud for real. He, he is a story. He's proud, and that's how that's what most white people think. That's what most devils think like. You know what I mean? They've gone around raping and robbing the whole earth, man. Their track record speaks for itself. You know, right. black people are the people that's one. Well. Imagine this for our band. They call us the criminals. They call us mm -hmm. the goons, and we were down behind bars. We don't harm nobody, man. We, you know who we do harm? We harm our own people, man. That's who we harm. Meanwhile, they harm every single nation on the face of the earth. This man just said it, man. He just said right. it. Every goes name a country that we haven't defeated, and it's correct. There's no country that the oppressor ain't dropped bombs on. There's no country, no race that the oppressor hasn't raped, robbed, and murdered. And of course, as I would say, pillage, man. Right. Rape, robbed, pillage is everybody, but we're the criminals because we got internal beasts, man. We got mm. internal wars, man. If you could have give me out over there one on one, man. Come on, come on. This man thinks that his his legacy will live forever because of he because he got a strong military, and he does. The oppressor has a strong military. His military is very strong, man. But make no mistake about it, it's coming to an end, man. That's I know he's seen so strong. He got tanks and missiles and heavy warfare. And his men are trained and they can blow up a country by pushing a button. I hear you, man. But let me tell you something. There's a black man called Jesus Christ. And guess what? Your missiles ain't faster than what he's bringing, man. The, but the weapons that you got ain't better than the weapons that Jesus Christ got, man. We that creepy bomb for sure. Khan or Khan. The book of Obadiah, chapter 1 and verse 5. If thieves came to thee, if robbers by night. No, give me, give me one. Stop, give me one and one, Baba Kusha, if you could. Can't, well, can't. There's four. Or slacky. I'll read from um from verse from verse two, in fact. Quite. Well, I, I, I want to know that it's talking about Edom. Can't. Get that part for me. Uh, okay. It says that in verse one, the vision of okay. Obadiah. Thus saith the Lord God concerning Edom. Concerning who? Concerning Edom. Concerning Eden, man, so we're talking about Europeans, man. We're talking about the French, we're talking about the Germans, we're talking about the Dutch, man. All these people, all these type, all these tribes of oppressors and Caucasians that had black, Hispanic, and Native Indians in slavery. That's who we're talking right. about. We ain't talking about Arabs. We ain't talking about Africans. We ain't talking about East Indians. We're talking about Eden. And the British are Edomites, man. And this is what the law says about them. We, we verse uh, three, Bob Shark. Kind of one, Verse three. The pride of thine heart hath deceived thee. The what? The pride of thine heart have deceived thee. And that's the thing, man. These devils are proud, man. They are proud. You see, uh, 1942, we beat them against. Uh, 1556, we beat them in Spanish, the Spanish Armada. We're here for them since. They're very proud, man. And, and they should be. That's the history. But guess what? 
as a black man, we should be even prouder, man. You That's know why? Right. Our history is greater than theirs, and our future is greater than theirs too. Our future is going to be greater than theirs. The Lord said that. Guess what? What? With the, um, when we defeat the oppressor, when Christ comes back and defeats the oppressor, it's going to be so glorious that we ain't going to talk about Egypt no more, man. No longer are we going to talk about Egypt. No longer are we going to talk about the Red Sea party, man. That's going to be nothing for what God's bringing. It's going to be no more. We're going to be talking about the river turning to blood and Moses and a pillar of fire by a day and you know pillar of fire by a night, man. It's going to be nothing. The way the Lord's going to tear this man down, it's going to be nothing, man. This man is proud, man. Why? Because it because the Lord's blessed him with the sword, man. And he's right. killed many nations and he's proud of his. No one can take him down. But the Lord said, What? The pride of thine heart hath deceived thee. And the Lord said, The pride of his heart, his pride, his, pr his pride has deceived him. When you're deceived, you ain't seeing the clear picture, man. This man thinks he's great and he will live forever and no one can take him down, man. He got so. Is he mistaken? A black man by the name of Yahweh is going to take him down. Black people, black men are going to be his future masters, man. Black men are going to be his future rulers, man. He's a deceiver. He thinks he's great right now. You know, we got the, the missiles and the bombs and Russia and Ukraine and England and all these Caucasian countries. A black man, the black man, the same black people that you hate and call niggas and talk about in your house and make snide mm -hmm. comments about and put drugs in their neighborhoods. They are going to be your future masters, man. You're going to have to call them same black men, sir. The same black man you see on, on the um, park bench with a, needle, with a needle in their vein and a six can of lager. And the same black woman, you go, mm, look at them whores, man. They're going to be your superiors, man. That's your right. pride that deceives you. It's like your album, man. If you want to chime in. Khan, I, I got a point after you, if you want to continue on the scripture and break it down. No, go on, go on. We are... Khan, I was just going to say, you know how they always say, you know, Whenever we bring up slavery and the atrocities that they did to our people, they always say, oh, you know, it was in the past. Forget about it. You got a chip on your shoulder. But they remember every they remember every little detail, every victory that they've had. And they brag about it. They brag about all the wars they've won, all the, the, the nations they've conquered. And don't, don't think that they ain't bragging the same way. You think it's just this, this devil. They brag in the same way about their, how they had our people in slavery and how they have us in this, this condition that we're into this day. They're bragging to this day about that. So when they 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 try they, they put in our, our people's mind oh it's in the past or you know you know it ain't like that no more I didn't own slaves they're bragging and they 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 know what they've done and they know how they benefit off us to this day See exactly that? and they these are the same devil talking about yo slavery's in the past put it behind you so why yeah. is he bragging about the past man that's right I the past is not, I thought the past is no more it's done it's behind us he's there bragging about the past. That's what they, they believe that they're the greatest country in the base of the earth and no man can take them down. Listen, Egypt fought that, man. That's once right. upon a time, listen, once upon a time, blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indians were slaves in Egypt. We were, the pe we were the people that everyone laughed at. We were the people that was, you know, servants. And to one day, them same servants, the Lord heard their prayers, man. And this is where the Egyptians are right now, man. In the dust somewhere, in the dirt somewhere, in Sudan, man. And they, they ain't rich no more. They ain't great no more. Could you imagine about how, how Egypt was back then? We're talking mm. about a time when there was no bulldozers, no uh, scaffolding, no tractors. And in Egypt back then, they had skyscrapers, man. That's what a pyramid is. Egypt is what Manhattan back then, Central London back then. Could you imagine the technology they had? They were the greatest country in the face of the earth, and niggas overthrow them, man. Right. The Lord overthrow them with the same people that were slaves that built the same pyramids. The same people that work in nine to fives, the same people that you throw in jail, man. They're too proud, man. The devils are proud, man. And let me tell you something, he's proud of his history. We're proud of our history. And our That's history true. is greater than his history, man. Let me tell you about our history. There's a man in our history called Samson, man. There's a man in our history called King David. There's a man in our history called King Solomon, the greatest man, the, the wisest man to ever live, man. Samson, one of the strongest men to ever live, man. Moses, the same man that they make movies about, man. Joshua. A strong, a, a strong, mighty man in Israel. Our knowledge, our history is better than theirs, man. Mm -hmm. Black people, we feel that we ain't got no knowledge. We feel that we ain't got no history. Whenever we speak about history, we think of, we speak about the African man's history, man. You hear black men bigging up African man's history, talking about yeah, because the pyramids and blah blah blah. That ain't our history, man. Our history is greater than them Africans, man. Greater than the white man's, man. Way greater than theirs. All the greatest people in the Bible come from us. In our history, you will find one man killing a thousand men. In our history, when you hear that God parted the Red Sea, man. In our history, when you hear about one man killing a whole army with a jawbone of a donkey, man. 
no one else in the street. So he can keep the Spanish Armada and beating the French and all that nonsense. There. That's nothing compared to what, um, our history, man. It's a lot of man. And and so like, if I could uh, on 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 that same video on, on how he's bragging about all the wars that he's uh, all the wars that England and, and Britain have won, you know Britain loves to portray themselves as like they're you know they're peaceful or that like they're moral. They need to teach other nations how to like they, they always want to push that LGBTQ nonsense yeah. to other nations, but they want to put this this image as if they're peaceful and you know they give aid to all these countries. But I, I, as it as it reads in the scripture, and as this this devil just showed us, war is in this man's heart. That's right. Nothing but war. And if I could get that scripture in a, a Psalms fifty five, but sure. Uh, Book of Psalms chapter fifty five and verse. Uh, let's see, verse twenty. Psalms fifty five and verse nineteen. God shall hear and afflict them, even he that abideth of old. Salah. Because they have no changes, therefore they fear not God. Mm. And it's that same oppressor that was back in the day, the same oppressor you see today, man. They have no changes. And they don't fear the most high. They, they, they say when they have us in, in, in chains, in prisons, they had us in slavery, they said, praise be to God for I am rich. And it wasn't yeah. our God that they were praising. They were praising good old white Jesus that made them rich, man. And if I hey, you know, right? The so called... The so-called British man appears so innocent. I like, I like that one. Right. With the, with the tea and crumpets and drinking with your, 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 your pinky like this and just having a good time and watching a football match, man. It seems oh. so innocent. And Boris Johnson, you know, you can't comb his hair. You know, they, they come across as so innocent. But these are the biggest murderers on the face of the earth, man. The That's British right. Empire had the biggest empire, bigger than Spain, bigger than France, man. Murdered, um, murdered blacks, Hispanics, Native Indians, man. You know what I mean? They're the reason why Jamaicans speak English, man. They're the reason why Trinidadians speak English. They're the reason why people in Australia speak English, man. They're the reason why people in Barbados and Trinidad and Montserrat speak English. They're the reason. They're the reason why the Native American Indians were killed, man. They're the reason why the Aboriginals are extinct. We get the so harmless. So yeah, I'm going to the going down 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 the pint. You know, I'm going down to the, the pub with my mates having a little pint and a lager. You know, I ain't harming nobody. You're out there, pal. You're out there, chap. That like the soul innocent. These are the biggest murders on the face of the earth, man. That's right. The black people are what's we we what's we are what's wrong with the world. These are people that appear nice and loving. Meanwhile, they murder everything working, man. They steal right. oil from different countries, man. They push their Christianity and enslave black people, put drugs in our neighborhoods, man, and cram us into council estates and they say that we're the problem. And appear so loving and nice. And you right there, pal. Yeah, I'm going to the down 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 to the pub and have a little bindaloo. They're wicked, man. Scripture you right. pulled out, you know what I mean? That's 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 bang on, that's spot on, man. That's that's them. Come, yeah, come. Ain't no one more wicked than than the British, man. Right. Like and so, lucky if I could, uh, it's like you know they they come with their suit and ties and they they look you know they come with their hair combed over, a little part into the side and, oh, and like, just, you know, <laughs> the elbow patches, all all that nonsense, man. And uh, the Christianity <laughs> on people's minds, it makes them think like, oh, you know, they're. They're the good people. They're the pure, you know, pure white and all that nonsense. Like, they're, they're the angels. They're angelic. But as you said, man, they are the biggest murderers on this planet. Absolutely. Do you know, do you know, you see them same British men that you see today, you know, they wouldn't harm a fly, so-called. Yeah. See your descendants from good old British men. It was good old British men that ripped open black women's legs, man, and raped them, That's man. Right. Good old British Christians that went to church on Sunday that whipped black men's back, man, and made them work from sun up to sundown. Cutting canes, swinging a machete every single day, sweating in the hot sun, man. Good old British Christians did that, man. So don't tell me the Christians are great people. And it does wicked about them too. When, whenever a black man kills somebody, like as black men, we might kill someone because why? They killed our cousin. Right. Or they're from one side of town and we're from the next. And we're beefing, we're in a gang war. And in that gang war, you know, I don't like. The other side of town, why could they kill my cousin? They kill my good brethren, I can't get over it. And you know what they do? They make out like, oh man, these black men are animals, man. Look at them killing each other, man. When it's, it's, it is silly, but I can see why. This brother wants, wants payback for his cousins, man. Wants payback for the brethren that, that you killed. And they make out like, oh, he's just an animal. Meanwhile, ain't no one a greater murderer than him. That's right. This man that said it in the video, you've murdered many nations that, that, that did nothing to you. 
If we're wicked, then what are you? Right. What did the Aborigines ever do to you? Mm-hmm. What did black people in the time of slavery ever do to you, man? Right. You know, what did the Aborigines in Australia ever do? What did the Native American Indians ever do to you, man? The Native American Indians showed you how to plant through the winter and how to survive, and you murdered them, man. You know why? Because you are the real murderer, not us, man. That's right. You're the, the heartless man and the clown. You're the one, you're, 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 you're the heartless and merciless one, not us, man. They say, oh, black, black men in them gangs. Oh, God, in them gangs. They fight for it. They fight for it um, at ends that they don't even own. Meanwhile, you're fighting for a football team that you that, that you don't even own, man. You're the hooligan fighting for a football team and cracking people's heads and throwing bottles and throwing bricks, man. That's right. Well, imagine this album here. Imagine this, you're fighting for a team here, both right. losing your life, and the players that play for the team are getting paid. The <laughs> players that play for the team get, get paid for the team, get paid millions, and are in their cushy mansions. While you're mm-hmm. fighting for bricks, but but we're the animals. Right. Yeah, you've got anything else to say? No, you can say it. My mom, I got plenty to yeah. say on this topic. <laughs> God, <laughs> God, and like, like how they portray it in the news, like as you were saying, whenever a black man does something, it's always oh gang related, and it's all it's it's like oh uh, uh, we just can't get it right, and we're all just thugs and hooligans. Whereas whenever one of them commit a crime, an atrocious crime, it's always oh you know he was mentally ill or, or you know. Certain, there's always some excuse or some way they paint him in, in a better light. But when it, whenever one of us gets gets even gets killed unjustly, oh, they they they're they brought up that he, he stole a pen in, in primary school or he, he, has, oh, he has a criminal record. He stole a friggin' uh, uh, some tires or some shit, some some petty crime. And yet, you know, you know, anything they do to justify killing us and to justify their killing, that's what they do consistently. I don't and know. It, about- what, what, what you said, you say you said that there was key. Do you notice? Do you notice how he named loads of countries that the British murdered? Right. But do you notice when the British murdered people, it's not murder, it's a victory. Mm. It's a right. victory. When you kill, it's a murderer, you're a disgusting murderer, you know. Uh, what's his name? Vladimir Putin's a disgusting, filthy murderer. Saddam Hussein is a disgusting murderer. We got it overthrow him because he's a murderer. And he don't like this country and that country. Meanwhile, when the oppressor kills people, it's a victory. When they slaughtered the Native American Indians, it was a victory. We discovered mm-hmm. the land and we rid it of all the people that were making the land disgusting and we cleaned it up. He killed the Spanish, it was a victory. They killed the Ugandans, it was a victory. They killed Canadians, it was a victory. That's because this man, it's like a different devil, man. So That's victory. right. Okay. And well, if yeah, I'm I'm... Really like, lucky, you know what I mean? Um, like... I made some chicken like... independently for the first time today. You know, it's a bad one. Oh, oh boy, this is like, this is like, next time you come down here, you gotta try it, man. Slap. Yeah, you know. Yeah. Moving on, anyways. Next one. If I could read on the description. Oh, boy, it's like, yeah. Come on, come on, come on. He had put forth his hands against such as be at peace with him. He had broken his covenant. Mm, go on, bro. Come on. So all, all these nations that he's, he's um, you know, talking about how he, he, you know, they were victorious over them. A lot of these these nations didn't do anything to this oppressor, man. Like I mentioned, the the Aborigines. What did the Aborigines do to the British? Nothing. <laughs> Colonized them, murdered them, took over their land. What 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 did West Indies do to the British? We did nothing but serve them, build their their NHS, build their their infrastructure. But yet they murder us. They they ship us back to Jamaica. They they do all all, all these things, man. They put their hands against those uh, that, that that are at peace with them. And that's the MO of this oppressor. Yes. Imagine that. It, not a little one better. The Native American Indians loved him. Calm. When they didn't have to, they welcomed him up. They welcomed him. You know mm-hmm. what I mean? When we came to England, was we welcome? Nah, man. We, we was gully ones, man. We had to piss up back to our country. Listen, you can live here, but listen, you got to pay double the rent to live in a room. Meanwhile, right. our brothers weren't like him. We welcomed him in. You know what he did? Put small pots in our blanket, man. Mm-hmm. Put us on reservations, man. Put us on, man. Don't get off him. He's on the devil, man. Tell us, man. Gotcha, gotcha. Yeah. Are they me a tricks? Sham Jeezy. Haratia. When me say you be care, you care. Well, anyway. We there, yeah, I will a rims on the ends. Me and me tag them, I will a mates on the ends. 
every man ya so lose friends from the ends time in Babylon I put stress but we head from the ends we feel this from the ends every man I try be the next from the ends dog we fly out and one bends from the ends but we die out and more dead from the ends where me come from you lucky if you live long day in the war zone but I know Pakistan na the place where you juvenile are the big man graver you do time bread a big one yo man a fee bleach but I never never zone na the six pants and the rifle we kick stand quick answer to enemy them response you with dead if you are Christian devil them strong we say but it's a trick done them one we fall down in a the quicksand me kill a them with they a land and England teach me say the white man him is a trickster the same struggle man a face in a Kingston a same struggle them a face in a Trinidad all the way go to Birmingham Brixton the link strong it no matter what the distance hey boom we day a a whole a rents from the ends me and me dark them a whole a mates from the ends Every man ya so lose friends from the ends Time in Babylon a put stress from we head from the ends We feel this from the ends Every man a try be the next from the ends dog We fly out and one bends from the ends But we die out and more dead body then Once upon a time round ya so did nice Full of vibes man a play football shoes aside If I no football you like one go shoot your dice But everything change when me nigga lose him life Go for crime a certain black a figure scrutinize Check every taxi on the route a drive them you to ride them to connive Man have to sleep a day and shoot a night And watch your head back you never know a hoof a time round ya no safe again Watch out for the eight of them and the three of them And the fake friend dog the eight of tens No solution for make amends Babylon says he's fire but we nah no fate na dem a sake of them Make the crime I'm rate so great again, and Jamaica red at like the equator belt of Jamaica bread. Cause you never break no red with the ghetto youth. Them you send the Terminator them dad. So man a fi wall a rims from the ends. Me and me dark them a wall a mates from the ends. Every man ya so lose friends from the ends. Time in Babylon a put stress but we head from the ends. We feel this from the ends. Every man a try be the next from the ends dad. Fi fly out and one bends from the ends, but we die out and more dead from the ends. Lucky if you live long, they in a the war zone But I know Pakistan is a place where you juvenile are the big man Pray for you do time, bread a big one, dad Man a fee bleach, but I never never zone Now the six pants and the rifle with kickstand Quick answer to enemy, them respond You with dead if you are Christian, devil in strong hands a trick done, them while we fall down in a the quicksand, me kill a them where they a land and England, teach me say the white man him is a trickster the same struggle man a face in a Kingston, a same struggle them a face in a tricky bad, all the way go to Birmingham Brixton, the link strong it no matter what the distance